It's story time! Got a quick one for you today. Today I'm going to share with you what is probably the dumbest comment I've ever received about my hair. Now, it's certainly tough competition for the title of dumbest comment ever, but this one has stuck with me for years, so I think it just clinches the title. Now, in fact, I received this comment before I even had dreadlocks. This is when I just had medium, longish guy's hair. When I was growing out my hair for my dreadlocks, I received this comment and it's got to be like... 13 years ago, if not longer, and it's still here, it's still with me. Anyway, I had a girl, a teenage girl with ass length hair, come up to me totally unprovoked and exclaim, guys can't have long hair. And I'm like, what? what? And she repeats, guys can't have long hair. And I ask, why? And she says, they get lice. Dumbfounded, she stands there with her ass length hair and tells me that as a guy, I can't have medium longish hair because I'm gonna get lice. No hint of irony. <laughs> now look, I took something positive from this exchange and that's why I'm sharing it with you today and that's why I, I keep it with me. And I was just a kid at the time, but I, I always remember this, this little incident because it taught me something. And it taught me that it doesn't really matter what you do, whether you involve yourself or don't involve yourself, what you're doing, where you are, there are always going to be people who, they, they just have this thing where they decide that they, they want to have a, a, a pick at you, a, a critique. They have a criticism and they're going to share it with you. And it's really easy to let this stuff get to you and you shouldn't. <laughs> You can spend your whole life trying to fit this mold of what you think is going to make your life the easiest, but there's still going to be someone out there who's going to find some way to just, just have, a, have a little dig. And this stuff can really easily stick with you. Look, I remember this years down the line, but I know that that girl will have no recollection of this, so why am I holding on to stuff when the people who actually do the criticizing They'll have no idea about it. Now, this case is slightly different because I'm holding on to it so that I can learn something from the exchange. But in a general day-to-day -day life, I think you just need to get on and do you and <laughs> remember that you're not living your life for someone else. And if someone gets their kicks with criticizing others, then mm, it's kind of sad. What's the dumbest comment that you have ever received about your appearance, dreadlocks or otherwise? Share it down in the comment section below. Let's see what's really going on with the people that like to dig at others. <laughs> I hope this video was somewhat helpful to somewhat some of you, and I hope to see you again next time for the next one. Farewell! Does this white balance make me look orange? Yes. Yes it does.